Hey guys, John back with more Tight Medical Center tips for health and wellness that you guys can take advantage of. So today I want to talk about a major pillar of these tips and that's nutrition. So nutrition is essential. It's essential for your body physically, mentally, and for performance wise. Even if it was a race car, you want to put 93 octane in there, not regular 87 gas. Same thing with food sources. You want to get those nice premium good food sources so your body can perform, it can heal itself better, and it can work at optimal levels. That's what we're here for, right? Feeling the best you possibly can each and every day. And nutrition plays that strong role in this, okay? And knowing your nutrition, how many calories you're taking in, how many carbohydrates, how many proteins, how many fats are in your diet per day, per meal, now, I know it sounds real complicated, but it's really, really not. You can actually look online and Google and find a calculator with your body weight, your body fat percentage that will actually break down how many of these macros, proteins, carbohydrates, and fats that you need per meal per day. And this will ultimately set you up with a great plan of action, which you can go forth with. You know what you can eat every day, you know when you should eat every day, and you know how much you should eat every day. Now, a lot of people, they really just don't know about nutrition. They eat the most garbage stuff out there, and they probably feel like garbage and their body reflects the exact same way. And if you're one of these people, you really do want change. You might just not know how to get that change. And that's where I really wanna help these people. Because people, if they have that education and knowledge and information, then they're not, not ignorant. That means they're not uneducated about it. They know exactly what they can do and they can put it in play. And I think if people are educated about it, then they would be more confident for them to go out and to choose their meal plans, okay? And meal plans can be set up by you at home. They can be set up when you're at your job. So let me give you the examples of that. So if you're at home, you can pick a day of the week or two days out of the week. We really wanna do some food planning, right? meal prep is what we call it. And that's just getting together what your meals are gonna be for the week or for a couple days. Getting some Tupperware, setting you know your carbohydrates in there, some of your fats and some of your proteins in one dish and your greens, whatever it is, and you're all set to go. And you can set up like four to six of these Tupperware dishes and be good to go for two or three days. Now you set yourself up for success because all you have to do is take that bad boy, and if you go to work, throw in a microwave, um, there's little heating pads you can get that will keep those meals warm. Now, if you forget or you say, I just don't have time, so what do I do now? Well, beautiful thing about technology is, is we have Uber and we have all these meal food delivery services. And the way that they work is, is you can pick pretty much anything you want from any of these different restaurants or whatever it may be. Now, the key to this is finding the most basic, bland things. Of course, you can order the most craziest, richest, uh, you know, spaghetti with all this marinara sauce and whatever it is, or whatever you like, you know, a, a cheeseburger, it's greasy or whatever. But you can also get grilled chicken breasts, right? Grilled chicken with maybe some white rice or some regular potatoes on the side um, that don't have a lot of salt on them or anything like that. And you guys can eat these at your job. They can get delivered right to you. It's hot, fresh, and ready to go. You know, you don't have to meal prep. You don't have to do anything. You just have to order. You know, some people, they're like, oh, I don't, you know, I, I really didn't know that. But this is something that you guys need to utilize in your resources. Because everybody has a cell phone, I think, a smartphone. Everybody utilizes it, especially right now. Um, and everybody knows about Uber Eats and all these different food services that deliver food to you guys. You guys can also go with a meal prep company. There's plenty of meal prep companies in the country that offer a wide variety of dishes for you guys if you guys really have a problem with food planning or even getting it delivered to you. You can have this delivered to your house and you guys can have meals for the whole week or a couple days, whatever it may be. So don't make the excuse that you cannot get your nutrition plan on point. There's no excuse for that. Like I said, you are what you eat. That old saying is so true. It rings so true. And once you start eating healthier, you're gonna feel healthier all the way around. Like I said, you're gonna look better because it's gonna help you, I guarantee it, with lean muscle mass, losing weight. Mentally, you should feel better because that good food source is gonna give you the nutrients you need for your body to work optimally. You know, these are different things that you need to think about. And that's really the first thing that I tell people to really get in check. When they come to me, I say, listen, get these two things in check, maybe three. And that's nutrition along with activity and proper sleep, right? But nutrition 
is, is far one of the biggest things I think that people need to focus in on these days and people really don't. Um, and people go for all kinds of marketing scams because they look at boxes of food they buy and it says organic on it, but you look on the back and the ingredients, and you're like, oh my God. So it's really essential for you guys to know what you're intaking in your body. And that also includes, if you are buying it from a, a, a supermarket or whatever, to look at the ingredient label, right? To know what is exactly in that food that you're intaking because your body is going to absorb it and then try to break it down. So this is just one major pillar that I want to talk to you guys about and really, really cover in depth. And that's nutrition. So get your nutritional plan together and I guarantee all these other things will align right along with your activity, you sleeping better, and then you'll start feeling better, looking better, and performing better. Like I said, guys, these are just some tips and tricks that I want to help you guys out with from Titan Medical Center. I appreciate you guys tuning in and come back for our next segment when I'll talk about activity and sleep and how important those two things are as well. Thank you for tuning in. I'll see you guys soon. Running through the last of my thoughts Standing on the edge of my chance Everything I know will be gone in a minute And that's alright Running through the last of my thoughts Standing on the edge of my chance Everything I know will be gone in a minute And that's alright Alright cause I'm free What's up guys, John here from Titan and today I want to talk about one of my favorite therapies and a new therapy a lot of our patients are taking advantage of. That is NAD. So NAD is an awesome therapy. It's a coenzyme. It's in every living cell of the body. Think about that. Every living cell and increases ATP which is going to mean more energy for you guys. So if you guys want more energy, you guys don't want to feel down, lethargic, right? Put putting each day then NAD could possibly be the therapy for you guys. Now, another great benefit of it, cognitive enhancement. That's right. So if you guys want more clarity, right, more mental clarity, more focus, being able to be lasered in on something, then NAD could definitely be the therapy to help you guys out. It works by actually repairing on a cellular level. So neurons decrease while we age, NAD levels decrease while we age, 
So at this point, it repairs those things in the brain to make you guys think a lot better. Just in layman terms for you guys, okay? It also help athletic performance too as well. Think about it. If you have more mental clarity and you have more energy, that's gonna help you overall all around. Another thing it's used for is addiction recovery, Alzheimer's, dementia, and a lot, lot more. So they're doing a lot of research on this. So it's a great thing. Now, to get this therapy, it's real simple. You can either call or text us at 727-389-3220 and get this great therapy shipped to you guys so you can self-administer, or you can actually come in the office and get it in an IV with different things if you want or by itself. And this will give you a ton of different benefits either way that you do it. So if you guys are interested in NAD or want to know more about it or want to become a patient and be on this therapy, then call or text us and also check out the website www.titemedicalcenter.com. I'm John from Titan and I appreciate you tuning in. Hey guys, I'm sure with everything going on right now, you guys are worried about your immune systems and your health. So don't worry guys, Titan Medical Center has your back. We have the tools to help you build your immune function so you guys can hopefully not get sick or hopefully get over sickness quicker. Let's talk about some of the therapies that Titan Medical Center has. One is glutathione. Glutathione is a super antioxidant that will help build your immune system and hopefully help you get over sickness quicker. Now, you can do this in the comfort of your own home, office, or car by a little needle like this, an insulin needle with an intermuscular injection. You can also come in the office and get an injection of glutathione by itself, or you can be put into an IV to help you out there. Let's talk about another one, zinc chloride. So zinc right now especially is very, very popular. And this is a good one to help you boost your immune system as well. A lot of people take it over the counter. A lot of people are taking this over the counter and taking some of these things over the counter would be non-effective or not as effective. Mm -hmm. The reason why the transportation rate and the absorbency is a lot better through an IM intermuscular injection or through an IV intravenous through an IV, right? So at that point, you'll get better results or absorb a lot more and faster through these injections or through an IV. Well, let's not forget though, also with over-the-counter things, you really don't know what's in it. There's nobody that's actually regulating that stuff to right. tell you that if it is 500 milligrams on the label, is it really 500 milligrams in the pill? That's true, that's true. And that goes as for, go for it, vitamin C. Vitamin C is another one. And this is injectable form that you can give intermuscular to yourself, or you can come down to the clinic and get it done here for yourself. Now, let's remember what she said. You don't know what you're getting in an over-the-counter supplement. It's not being regulated like it is from a US licensed pharmacy. Everything that Titan Medical Center does is prescribed by a medical provider and comes from a US licensed pharmacy. So you know you're getting the very best for your body. Let's talk about another one, alpha lipoic acid, another major antioxidant. The best thing about these are, is you can mix them in an IV bag and get all these things. You can do these in intermuscular shots like we talked about. So you're gonna get a lot more bang for your buck and a lot more benefit from taking these intramuscular or through IV. Now remember when he says intramuscular injection, it's with a very tiny baby insulin syringe. Someone like me, I'm not too fond of needles. But in a crisis like this, I guess I'm gonna suck it up and take the shot. <laughs> yeah. We also have Nectar of the Gods, which is a great one that has glutathione and NAC, which is cystocystalline. So at that point with arginine and with lysine, which is another immune system booster, it's got another couple of ingredients in it that will help you A, perform better, B, build up your immune system, and you should feel better on these injectables. So if you're looking for the very, very best for your body, then call or text Titan Medical Center, 727-389-3220. Ask us about our immune system boosters and all our great blends that we have for you guys. Please check out TitanMedicalCenter.com and always check out our social medias for all the great new things that Titan Medical Center has coming. What's up guys, I'm John. I'm Sharice. And we are back with another Cupid's Corner. 
Welcome to a new year. <laughs> it's 2021. 2021. <laughs> yeah. Bye bye 2020. See ya 2020. Down the toilet you go in 2021. Hopefully you're going to bring us a whole bunch of sunshine. I already deleted 2020 anyway. Uh, 2020 is already gone? It's already gone? It's gone. Well, hopefully it's gone in your guys' mind too. I, I think 2020 affected everybody in a negative way, one way, shape, or form. Mm -hmm. Whether it be personal, relationship, because you guys couldn't stand each other because you guys were next to each other all the time. <laughs> and that's not a usual thing, right? <laughs> um, you know, hopefully you guys are all right. And hopefully you're going into 2021 with a breath of fresh air, right? Ready to start a brand new year, a brand new you, right? And with that should come a lot of different other things. So you should be wanting to progress every year, right? Or every day. Every day, for when, sure. You know, I mean, in one way or another... You should be learning a new word. You should be trying to do better at your job, do, do physical, uh, health-wise, whatever it may be. But you should be progressing in some of these different areas, okay? And, you know, some people need that New Year's resolution to really start off, right? <laughs> yeah. To start that year off. Now, me, uh, I think Sharice is the exact same way. Like, we make these New Year's resolutions like, oh, we're going to, you know, we're going to do a lot better than this, this, and this. But I think we're motivated every day. I know. I kind of just made my resolution like daily. So when I wake up, I'm like, okay, so we're going to do this today. Right. I'm going to do it tomorrow. I'm like, okay, we're going to do this tomorrow. <laughs> it's just a daily thing. You want to be better than yesterday. I think it's all about setting goals, like setting daily goals, weekly goals, monthly goals. Monthly goals, Right? Yeah. Setting those goals and then setting time periods of where you need to hit it. Even if you're at work. So she says it with some of the employees, she'll set you know, the amount of work and how much time they have to complete that work, <laughs> right? So it's not a forever thing. You're not just, you know, going on and on with this this one thing. And that's really how you should be, you know, whatever goal it is. So whether it's a relationship goal, which you should always want to improve on, and it is a job, okay? Mm -hmm. So if you're in a relationship, don't think that you can just get into it. At that point, you're like, all right, I'm in this. Uh, everything's, you know, where it needs to be. Now I'm going to become complacent, right? Mm -hmm. um, that's not going to work. You know, you guys good. are going to grow apart or something's going to happen. Where yeah, they get old. Like, you know, it gets old after, like, so long. It gets old. And you got to do something to make it better. It, it doesn't even have to be in the bedroom because I'm sure that's where everybody's head goes. But it doesn't even have to be like that. It could just be anything. Do something different together. You know, me and John went roller skating with our son not yep. that long ago, which was kind of cool because oh, yeah. it kind of brought back some memories of, like, our childhood. And we were able to share that with each other. But it was different. And it's great physical activity. Yes. Especially that's when another you fall. Good. It was great. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Make sure you don't fall or hurt yourself, okay? <laughs> you're not 15 anymore, John. Oh, uh, you're not going to bounce back maybe as fast. But it's a good, it's it's one of those good things. Like, like she said, like, you know, we go, we're together. You know, if you have a family, awesome. It's great sharing that family time and sharing that nostalgia, right, of when we were kids and, and be able to pass that on to our son. But if you're just a couple, that's another bonding experience. It's something that maybe one of you or both of you were good at, like me and Sharice, back in the day. And it brings back those good memories, and you can share those memories with your partner, which, you know, in turn, it just shares more about you, and it gives a more inner look at who you are and where you came from, which is great, right? So you want to open up to your partner in those ways. And you want to do these new things. So find something new. Now, depending on which state you're in, you might have some restrictions, you might not. Mm. Uh, you know, do whatever you need to do. But at that point... Find something that you guys can do this year. Make a goal. Make a plan um, that you guys can follow through on. So if it's getting healthier together, better physical shape. I know we talk about this all the time. Mm -hmm. But it's really depending on you guys. And this is the beginning of the year. So think of the new year, new you type deal and uh, really put it in place. Put that goal in front of you guys and how you're going to get there. Not, not just saying, I'm going to be healthier this year. I'm going to be more active this year. What are you actually going to do? So it's really planning these things. It's planning your attack, per se, and going after it and really getting it. So whether well, it's a nutritional plan, find out somebody that can help you out with nutrition. If it's physical activity, you want to go to the gym, find somebody that can help you out, a real trainer. And don't, mm -hmm. don't uh, go for the bottom of the barrel. Make sure that <laughs> somebody, <your> it. <laughs> yeah, make sure somebody's educated, they have certifications that can really teach you these things proper ways because you don't want to get injured either. Mm -hmm. Right, that's another thing that comes along with physical activities. And when you get old, it's injuries. <laughs> so the proper things to do is like warming up, making sure everything's good, uh, make sure you're doing proper form. And we stuff have therapies like that. for that, by the way. We have therapies for healing <laughs> or, or injuries. So <laughs> I just mentioned inflammation. <laughs> you know, so we offer all, all these different therapies. 
Uh, the next thing is, is like I said, so if you guys are going to get in physical shape together, you guys are playing that together, that's awesome. Plan some sort of getaway. So me and Sharice usually go on vacation mm. at least two times a year Usually. for her birthday and for our anniversary. Mm -hmm. Doesn't look, we didn't do it last year, and we're in a new year. It doesn't look like we're going to hit our anniversary trip. That's January 21st. Mm. So uh, that's not good because we usually don't miss that, right? But, you know, we got to plan something else. Whether it's in the state of Florida where we're at and maybe going down and trying to do a getaway, which never really happens, right? <laughs> Even when we go out in the country, I think it that's happens. funny. <laughs> but, but you know, I mean, but other couples are different, right? So if you're working a nine to five, or maybe you're a business owner, you guys can go get this getaway in. You know, go to a hotel that you've never been to before. Um, for me, I would try to find a hotel, like a hotel room maybe has your own jacuzzi well, in it. Well, actually, no, we right? just did that not that long ago, and we did it because we didn't get to go anywhere. Remember? Yep. Yeah, yep. we went, and, and it was like because obviously we don't have any time, but it was local, right? Yeah. And it was a spa. Yeah. And we did like a whole day spa. Yeah. And it was so cool. Because nice. we went there and you know what they did? They made me put my phone in a locker. It was terrible. I just, I was so, I was so anxious. Cause I'm like, no, not my phone. So, but it made you, you know, be together. And yeah. that's what we did. It was really cool. And we got Quality massages time. and they had this little um, jacuzzi room yeah. and not like a hot, like a, what was that thing? The sauna. Yep. I had a sauna and you had it private like it was just you and your significant other yep. and then you got like a an hour and a half massage and then a facial scrub and you guys are together you know doing couple stuff and then they had like a little outside area where you could eat like in a little That's picnic cool. kind of deal so cool. it was really cool they let you bring your own champagne bottle that was cool yeah and then you know it was a, it was a day thing so we didn't have to go far it's here where we live and um, I didn't have to take the whole day away, so I was able to work in the morning. And then I still was able to close up, you know, shop. So it was nice. But it was different. You know, this is kind of, you know, an idea, I should say. Look for those little things around yeah, you. You might not cool. have even known they're there. Because, like, we didn't know this spa was there. No. I've been there for, like, nine, ten years. It was something <laughs> crazy. Like, like, hey, how long have you been here? Like, well, a year, six months? No, no, no. We've been here, like, nine, ten years. Like, oh, like, oh, wow. <laughs> didn't even know about this place. But very cool things. And in some of those places, you'll find these little, really cool things, like, like the room, like the one room they had like this huge tub where they had a hot bath with and a jacuzzi Thanks. too, right? They had the, the red light therapy, right? That was really cool. Mm -hmm. I mean, they had the shower for you just in this one room. And then they let you in there for a whole hour. So they had you in there the whole hour, you know, to have, you know, your own relaxing downtime. Um, you know, one, one thing that was really funny was like, don't lock the door and don't take your clothes off because there was that kind of mood in there. I could definitely see couples, you know, maybe, maybe get it on or whatever it is. But, you know, so they, they did put that warning out there. But it was just really, really cool to, to do that. Yeah, I, cool. I do agree. Um, you know, hitting a restaurant maybe you guys have never ate at before. That's, that's another one. I know we maybe talk about these different things. Now, me and Sharice really We're don't. Weird. We don't like to go outside our, our comfort zone, per yeah, se. We just eat at the same place. This is what we do. Literally, I'm not even kidding. It's so weird, okay? We eat at the same place, and we eat the same exact dinner when we go every single weekend. Well, it's been like that for 10 years. So, I mean, if they get the order wrong, that would be absolutely terrible. But it's the same exact thing. And that's okay for both of us because we want to do that, you know? Yeah. I think anytime we've ever had to venture out, I'm like, I don't know about this. Can we just go back? <laughs> <laughs> we, ha we have found some rarities, though, by doing that. Like, you know, like one favorite restaurant we couldn't go to at that point in time. I think one day we went to another one. It was like, awesome. Or, you know, when a friend recommends, we're like, oh, you know, like this other place, for beaches you know, this is the time. Now we eat every day through we eat. So it's just really crazy. Oh, right. So you might find those little those little gems out there that you might really like, or you might be a foodie, per se, and you want to go experience all these different things. and Or you might like to experience different things, or your palate might like different tastes. Mine doesn't, but hey, I don't listen. know what a palate is. Most people look at us like we're weird, and we look at you guys <laughs> like you're weird. So, <laughs> and you guys are judging us, don't, right? <laughs> <laughs> Even our friends are like, oh, you got to try this kind of venture out. They're like, like, I'm good. Nah. I'm good. Nah. You know, I mean, we, we were eating pizza last yeah. night, right? We like cheese or cheese and pepperoni. And oh, yeah. We went to a friend's restaurant that just opened. <laughs> and, and at that point, one of our friends was like, oh, you got to have the, the chicken the chi one. I'm like, like I'm the good. buffalo chicken no. uh, pizza. I'm like, no. Nah. <laughs> no. I'm good. They're like, it's so good. It's so good. I'm like, you know what? Then you enjoy that buffalo chicken pizza. <laughs> yeah. Let's stick to what we like, right? Yummy chicken pizza. <laughs>
<laughs> so these are just some things, man. I mean, 2021 should bring you guys a lot of happiness, a lot of joy, and a lot of progress, right? Um, you know, don't have a negative attitude coming into this year. With everything that's happened or still going on, keep the positive attitude. Try not to have that stuff bring you down. Concentrate on what really makes you happy. I, I think in 2021, that's uh, something I'm going to work on a little bit more, and I think everybody should work on that trying to make yourself happy just a little bit more, right? Because me, I like to make other people happy. That That's what, what I do. Like, you know, I, I like I like other people to be, I like to be a good host, right? And, and that function all the way around. So if people need stuff, I like to take care of it or whatever it you is. You just do that over and over and over and you kind of just disappear. It is, it you is. You know, we're, we're, we are professional yes. people. I mean, I should be, I should be a magician. Yes. Because I dis just disappear. <laughs> <laughs> But I mean, we're used to doing that, though. So I mean, that is a good point, yep. you know, to try to make yourself happy. Try yourself do things happy. to make don't be selfish. Happy. Yeah. But you know, try to to do some things that will make you ha more happier in twenty twenty one. AKA going to the gym because he never gets to go. That's me. And he needs to go. Mm -hmm. And he wants to go. Me. If he doesn't go, he's like, Arr! and I'm like, Arr! a lot so of work. I just you know, and it's not a lot of time he's asking for either. He's like one hour of the whole day, like a. Uh, that's all I'm asking, you know. Did that some days. Yeah, so 40, day, 40 half minutes. An hour, 40, 40 minutes. minutes. Push them through, you know. So it's, you know, it's little things that you know it, that can make a big difference for that sure. you, that will make you happy. Like you know, for me, it, for instance, you know, obviously for those of you that don't know or maybe do know, I got COVID in July, put me in the ICU, changed my life forever. Um, but one thing that makes me happy now, and I used to not care about it. Maybe I'm just getting old. Um, but I need my sleep. Uh -huh. Like I need, I didn't listen. I used to be like, when I tell you both, like both ends of the candlestick and on top of another candlestick, that is how I burned it. Just like that. So I was just go, 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 go. And I like that. Like I, that I feed off that like pace. I like that pace. Like, bop, 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 bop. but you know, when you burn all the way down to nothing, you kind of figure like, oh no. So now that I've, I've had to get the sleep for my health and just for myself now i'm like wow you know i do i like i feel much different when i get sleep yep. you know and i, I my immune system's better I, my mood's better i have more more energy you know I have more clarity when i think um there's a lot of different things that come with that and it's something small you yep. know all i'm asking for is like like actually seven hours like you know instead of getting just three so it's made a big difference for me. It's huge. I mean, the, the, the pillars, like we always talk about, activity, nutrition, and sleep. sleep. So if you guys want to feel better every day, <laughs> Go to get sleep. those three <laughs> things in. I promise you. Because if you're lacking in sleep, you're probably not going to be all there. You're going to be, you know, a little foggy-minded, slower-paced. Nutrition's another part of this. So you gotta you got to feed the beast, right? you got to feed the machine. you got to put that gas in the tank, you know, and... Um, you know, activity, you know, you want to make sure that blood is flowing. You want to make sure you're building your immune system. You know, your, your physical appearance is good, right? Because that's a huge point nowadays. So just make sure that you guys are getting these pillars in. I hope these tips have helped you guys out or will help you guys out in this beautiful new year of 2021. So Yippee. we are here for you guys <laughs> every week. Cupid's Corner. Please tune in. I'm John. I'm Sharice. And we'll see you next week on another Cupid's Corner.